like I say, I, I'm a new business and I'm starting to appreciate uh, one, being my own boss, having my own time to work. Um, but hand in hand with that, I've also been having trouble moving forward on my own. I, I can't promise that it's, it's sunny on the other side when you first start. The first couple of months are so important. Um, but things for me now are just starting to take off. So it is worth the wait and it is worth the effort that you put in. What I have found in the last couple of months is that everyone is on the same boat at the moment given the recession. Everyone is scratching each other's back for a favour. Mm -hmm. trying, try, trying to share clients, potentially get work that way. They're not, um, they're not trying to do anything different. And you find that the more you go to these places, you see the same faces. So you ask yourself, where, where's the progression in that? Is there another group you can find? We've decided to do a network with a difference. Hopefully this will be up your street. If it's not, not a problem. Um, we're looking to produce a group of people across the South that will generally work together to produce unique packages, services um, to those that need it. Now, it's not just necessarily catering for other businesses, it's catering for, for Joe Public. We could be doing uh, CD designs and covers and the next week we could be doing some local posters for a shop or even a birthday invitation for a kid's party. Anything like that. Um, on top of that, we're also looking to branch out as a community project. So we're very much looking to be in the public eye compared to other groups and organisations that will hide behind the door and let you come find them, um, which isn't as much fun. You, I'm sure you would prefer someone coming to you first in an introduction. Yeah. It, it, it takes that pressure off, doesn't it? We've done a voluntary project for Albion in the community, community. Is anyone familiar with them? Yeah. We recently put this together and we even filmed some of the work they were doing. Um, and we sent it straight to AITC. It's gone to the point now where they're actually that happy with it, they've sent it to FIFA uh, for adding endorsements, so we could be having their logo on there. I myself am a graphic designer, but I'm also an amateur photographer, so I've been able to marry the two together. Um, so pretty much everything on here has been my own work, including the photography on the back. Um, and through meeting Joel and his filming, he's also been able to do photography. He, uh, he's been filming events. Uh, he filmed the work that AITC were doing, so he joined us for a session. So far, this network is, has an idea that's happened. We've given it an image. We've given it a complete background about how we want it to work. We've even got a set of rules, a set of guidelines that, that people need to follow to make it happen. Going self-employed and the couple of months that we've had uh, on our own, we, we've learned how difficult it can be. So rather than try and be in it for ourselves, we're looking to help share solutions to those problems. You form a package that includes something that you have and something that someone else has. You set a price for that, you stick to it, and then you just advertise it locally and see if it bites. It's very experimental, but it's also a challenge. Um, it's also good for, for gaining contacts when you join the network. These people that you'll be working with, you could be working with further down the line, even when you no longer need the network, is to provide a platform that, one, will, will get you a steady, well, should hopefully get you a steady stream of income when you start out, and two, also boost your profile by being in sync with other businesses. Um, we've already got a Facebook page um, and a Twitter feed. We're working on the website for it at the moment, um, and we will also have a YouTube channel. Um, that can be to cover any projects we're involved with, it can be used to promote businesses um, who, who are members of the network um, and anyone else we're helping.